Hi, I'm Patrick from Alexandria Camping Center, here to show you the 2020 Momentum 29G Toy Hauler. So in the bedroom, you got a true 60 by 80 queen bed. You got some overhead storage over here. Nice window to look out there with little cubbies for your cell phone and stuff like that. You have a deep closet here with a rack. You have some drawers that allows you to put some of your stuff in. And you actually have your fuse panel down here below with a lot of countertop. You can enter the washroom coming this way. Or right from the entrance, you can enter the washroom from over here. Standalone shower. Again, I'm a short person, but lots of space. You got your sink right here. You got your mirror to look pretty in. Your medicine cabinet, porcelain toilet right there. Now we're in the main area of the trailer. 10 cubic foot fridge, Furion stove and oven, Furion convection microwave, deep farm sink with your pull down faucet. Lots of storage all over a place, so look how deep that is. More storage down here, places for your utensils. Your dog drawer, another drawer underneath the oven. Some space to put your DVDs or whatever the case you may want. Control center, built-in fuel tank in it. Right in front of the kitchen in the entertainment center, you have your Thomas Paine recliners. Deep cupboards, you can add, uh, use that as a pantry or something like that. And then here you have the entrance to your 11 foot garage. It's the first floor plan in a travel trailer for toy haulers that they've separated the garage and your living space. Your main washroom's at the front where I showed you, but over here you have a little toilet and your sink as well. Cool thing that I haven't seen very often is that you actually have some extra storage in the garage. Usually there's no type of storage, but here you've got a place to put whatever you want. Also, the garage is accessible from the outside to the inside. You don't have to go through your living space to get outside the trailer or inside. Here you have your other controls, secondary awning opening right there. You have your bed lift control. You have your lights, cable. If you want to add a TV, they've given you a backer area. This particular unit here has a dry weight of 8,700 pounds. Storage here with motion sensor lights as well. 18 foot awning, electric awning with LED lighting underneath the awning. You got your Rockford Fosgate speakers on the outside so you can really hear that music sound really good. Back entrance to the trailer where it gets you into the garage, your 11 foot garage. They've added these Furion lights on the side. You can add 360 cameras on the trailer. So you can have your backup camera in the back, but also you can have side cameras, just like you're seeing on a lot of vehicles these days with a 360 view. Here you have your area where you would add your generator. Right now there is no generator in it, but it does have your area. Control panel right here, which has your typical battery disconnect, your outdoor shower, your fresh tank fill, your city water. These Momentum Travel Trailer toy haulers come with 30 amp power. They also come with your five year warranty on the Westlake tires. As I mentioned previously, this travel trailer toy hauler has the fuel tank already inside. So instead of going to the gas station to fill up your Harley four wheeler, whatever toy you may have, um, you can do it right on site at your trailer. So here you got your fuel gauge to tell you how much uh, gas there is in the tank. Also, you have your fuel pump right here to be able to put gas in your toy. Take these two pins off, pull out the ladder like that. Full on walk on roof. You get your backup camera prep right there. The garage has a couple components to it. You can use it as a true ramp or you can use it as a nice patio deck in the back. So you take the two levers off like that and then you just pull on the door like this. So to use it as a true ramp door, you would bring it all the way down now there are four pins on each side that you have to take off, three and then four. And then all you do is you would simply lift this like that and there's your ramp door to bring in your Harley, your four wheeler, um, whatever toy you have. Now if you want to use this as a patio, 
And you've got these cables right here that create your support for the patio. And there's another clipping right here. So you would bring it up like that. So there's that side. Like that, so that creates your support structure for your patio deck. So I've already taken off the pins off the two sides over here. Simply lift this up and put the new pins back in place based on the configuration. So there's a Velcro here. All you need to do is take that off and then you'll see that there's some screw holes on the, this side and on the opposite side to be able to attach it together. I wanna thank you for taking the time to watch in this video. You could always go to our website at alexandriacc.ca to view our inventory and more trailers like this. You could also go on our Facebook page or go on our YouTube channel and look at all of our amazing videos that we do. And please don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day.